Do you want to get all the matching results with your VLOOKUP formulas? In this video, let me present a very simple Excel formula that will do that work for you. Here we are looking up for a salesperson named Ram Mahesh. And when I use a good old VLOOKUP formula like this, VLOOKUP D4, which is my Ram Mahesh in the sales table and get the fourth column data, I get the answer as 1624. But you can see that there is not just a single Ram Mahesh row. There's actually a few other places where this person is present. So what we want is not one choice, but all the results as a list, something like that. So how to do this? For this, we cannot really use the VLOOKUP function because VLOOKUP has a limitation that it will only look up and give you the first matching result. Excel has a newer lookup function as well, xlookup, and it also has the same limitation. You would think when Microsoft is adding these new formulas, they will give us a better way to show everything, but no. But Microsoft fortunately introduced a third new function, which will give us all matching results with a simple syntax. This function is called filter, and you just need Excel 365 to use this. You can also use the filter function in Excel online. So we'll use filter like this. We want to filter our sales table. Since we are only interested in seeing the amount column, we will say amount. So filter the sales table amount column and the criteria for filtering is sales table salesperson is equal to Ram Mahesh. So whatever is the input value, you just put that there and then close the bracket. It will give you all the values where that person is Ram Mahesh. Let's test this with Carla Molina. As soon as you finish typing the name, you press enter, you will see all the results for Carla's values showing up here nicely. Only limitation of this function is it will only work if you have Excel 365. But nowadays, most of us are already using Excel 365. So you should be able to straight away implement filter function to see the results. Let's say you just don't want to see the amounts. You want to see the product along with the amounts. In this case, what we will do is we will use a different filter function. We'll say filter. The data that we want to present is both product and amount column. So I'm going to select both of these columns in my filter function. So it says filter product to amount. I just want to filter everything where my sales salesperson is equal to Carla Molina. You will get all the matching product names and the amounts where this person is present. If you want to learn more about VLOOKUP, XLOOKUP and various other lookup functions in Excel and how to combine them and use them for business data analysis, I highly recommend checking out my new course on Skillshare. This one hour course will teach you all the concepts necessary to master Excel lookup functions for data analysis. Please check out the link in the video description through which you can sign up to the Skillshare platform and get free 30 days access to my course as well as many other courses on the Skillshare platform to learn and improve your skills. On the other hand, if you would like to know a little bit more about this filter function, I recently made a video about why filter is the best new function in Excel. Check out the video as well. It is shown right here on the screen. Thank you so much for watching this VLOOKUP multiple results video. I hope it has been helpful. I'll see you again somewhere else. Bye-bye.